Hello, and welcome to the showcase of my Pokemon cards. So my friend made a video showing his, I'll link that in the description, but for now, uh, here's my folder. And the lighting in my room is dark and moody, which is how I like it. So I'll use my phone light to supplement that a little bit. Well, as you can see, I have a bunch of stickers as well. I like these ones, a little Eevee. Use that as my profile picture sometimes. Got a bunch of different stickers on there. This one's nice. So, fun fact about this one is if you see a polywag that has, if I can get the lighting right, that has its spiral innards, if they're turning white like that, it means it's diseased and it's probably going to die. Anyways, show a bit more. Got nice colors on them. On the inside, that's crabby. I don't know if these are official stickers, they're probably just bootleg stickers or whatever, but got them a long time ago. Anyways, there's my Pokemon cards. And, uh, I like to choose certain Pokemon cards that are cool looking to put on the front of them. On the front of the folder. But I have a lot more, usually. Something like this. I don't have a nice setup for my camera here. Just need to bear with me. I don't have a Raichu or anything. I'm going to move on from this. But some of these ones are nice ones here. Like a Growlithe. I'm really not going to show too many. Sand slash. That's weird. I forget what you call these holograms, almost. I don't know why I have a puzzle here on this page. These are supposed to be old Pokemon. Let me see what's underneath it. I accidentally try not to bend them. This one's already a little fucked. That didn't... I didn't really track well. Manetrica underneath. Whatever. Not, not nearly as entertaining as my friend I know. Now, this is a nice one here. Limited edition Toys R Us before Toys R Us went out of business. Things a little bit weird. I think this is a fake one for sure. Well, it's definitely fake, but it's got nice colorings. You can see them. Charmander. Now, I don't have a Blastoise, 
even though that's one of my favorite Pokemon. He's coughing. So yeah, I have a Dunkle's Smogmog under here somewhere. German card. So look. I just think that's kind of interesting. You usually I just have evolution cards underneath, but a lot of these weren't too interesting to show. Some of them I don't really, don't really have. Now I think I have a couple of these. Quilava, Typhlosion. Here we go. It's a nice one. Look at that holographic. Here's my favorite card. I'm not even gonna take it out, but I'll just show you. Shining Kabutops. If I can track this correctly. It's pretty cool. Don't ask me why I put it upside down. I'm not so sure of myself. Cute swinebs. Here's my favorite Pokemon, Espeon, followed by Blastoise. Here's one my cousin gave me, it's very nice, Flareon. Much more holographics on this page. Here's some of my better cards. So this one is pretty expensive. Mido King. It's an e-reader card. That's why it's expensive. The Japanese Zapdos. I like this one. It's got a bunch of different sort of effects you can see. Take different pictures of it. It looks nice. Latios. I prefer Latios over Latios. Hello, sorry for the jump cut. I had a bit of an interruption. Anyways, 
as I was saying, I prefer Watios over Watios. I just, it's the one I always choose to show up. Here I have these three, Raikou, Entei, Suicune. If you line them up like this, the background all tracks into the, it's the same background. Actually, that's why I lined up these two. I feel like if you look closely, it almost looks like there's a Raikou tail in the background. It's kind of hard to see like this, but if you look on my banner image from my YouTube video, YouTube profile, it looks a little closer. Anyways, here's my most expensive card. Holographic Raikou. It's up, worth up to like $2,000 apparently. It's really nice. Got a Mew and a Mewtwo. I used to have the old ancient Mew that came from watching the first uh, first Pokemon movie. As it came out in theaters, they would give you one, but I lost that one along with my folder back then. Kind of made me sad. Oh well. I got a bunch of new cards that make me happy. The uh, couple Sneasels. It's one of my other friend's favorite Pokemon. Thought I'd show it some respect. Some Salamence, Giratina, newer legendaries. Palkia. Here's a card everyone loves. I don't have a holographic version, but this one's good enough. Rotom. Now here's something a little special. It's a bit creased. And anyways, came from a event recently where you went to. I think it's EB Games or Games or no GameStop, yeah and did some Pokemon card trading and they give you this and what actually came inside of that is one of these which I really like one of this is a coin a Witten coin which is one of my favorite Pokemon as well because of the description of it just totally it's like me the Pokedex description at least but there's all my trainer cards and energy cards. I have some some interesting ones, but I'm not really gonna take too many cards out, as I said earlier. a lot of them in this. And a few more stickers right at the end. Pocket monsters. You gotta be old to know that.
and that's it. There's no stickers on the back. So thanks for watching.